I'm gonna try and speak over the uh, air conditioning system, but we're uh, out here right now because my room is a bit of a mess. My desk has parts all over it, and I wanna take a look at this real quick. Boom, boom, boom. Look at that film. So what we have here is a pain in the ass. This is a Super 8 camera. This is the Canon 514XL. This is one of like the very popular ones, I would say. It's very highly regarded amongst people that are into things. I know a few of my friends really wanted to get one of these because it's lightweight. I mean, like it's, it's pretty tiny. And yeah, in terms of functionality, it like doesn't really offer a whole lot. Which is good because it's, what is that, the um, paralysis by analysis or something like that. So it has uh, 18 frames per second, 9 frames per second. Those are the two functions there. You load your film in like so. There's the different readouts in there depending on what it is you load. That feeds into the circuit board here with uh, how it needs to expose properly. I believe it's only an auto exposure. I don't think it, like, you can't control aperture or anything like that, which is nice. You have your zoom. There's a macro feature there. Focusing unit up here. You got your run button there. Your on off switch. Your one frame exposure. There's a self timer, which is interesting. A battery check, which, if you look through the viewfinder, You can kind of see there's like a there's a flash of a red light. That's the battery check. There's an LED that sits right here. Handle comes out. The handle's like super thin, which is funny because the Canon I think I had the 814. The uh, AA batteries actually sit in the handle, so the handle's like a lot bulkier. And then the Viceroy, which is the Super 8 camera that I have now, the handle also holds the batteries. So just different operations, which is interesting. I do know that it wasn't working when I got it first, and now it is. So basically just a magician. But yes, this is the Canon 514XL. I'll probably do a better breakdown version of this, but this is just the intro to the repair. Now we're all on the same page. Let's, uh, let's get to it.